this, as I was saying, I need a wife. And, and I'm, not, I'm not talking about just any woman. I want a woman that is down to earth, a woman that will love me. And I know you can get one from me. I know what you like. I know you can get one from me. I've actually been waiting for this for some time now. Mm -hmm. Isn't it about time? Well, don't worry about that. I, there's actually someone I have in mind. My friend. She's, she's a nice girl. Wife material. You'll like her. Okay, I would like her, but will she accept me? <sighs> Leave that to me. I'll talk to her. She's actually my best friend. Okay. So, when do I get to see this wife material? Tonight? Uh, uh. <laughs> oh, you're such in a hurry. Oh, well, don't worry. Just give me till weekend. Let me do the wine. I'll wait. Mm. Ah, how could you really need a wife? Ah, ah. You need someone to eat this your money with you now. <laughs> you can say that again. <laughs> I'll wait till weekend. Doris, I can't accept your uncle's proposal like that without seeing him or getting to know him. Doris, don't miss this chance. Oh. My uncle is a very wealthy man. By the time he'll use his money to arrange your body. <laughs> I want to recognize you again. Better grab this offer while it lasts. So. Are you serious? Your uncle is a very wealthy man. Like wealth is all it takes to marry a man. Whatever happened to love, intimacy, the kind of marriage that will give me peace of mind. Oh yes, you're right. Okay, look, don't misunderstand me. What I'm trying to say is that my uncle is a good man. You like him. Doris, you are my best friend. I can't deceive you now. I can't possibly push you into a life of torment. All I want is the best for you. Felicia was right about her description of you. So you are a ray of beauty. <laughs> Chief, I am flattered. Flattered? Do I look like I'm flattering you? I'm not good at flattering anyone. I'm telling you the truth. And I like you as a person. Thank you. Good. See, there is, there is no need beating about the bush. I'm sure Felicia must have told you a lot about me. I want you to be my wife. <laughs> Just like that? Are we not supposed to take some time off and... And get, get to know each other, right? Exactly. Of course. That's not a problem. What is important here is that I like you and I want you to be my wife. Please, will you marry me? No, because I did that barely two weeks ago. Let's not spoil it, please. See, it's not their fault that they were born with silver spoon. So whatever they desire, they get, okay? There you go again. I still think they're fine for now. Maybe next month. All right. How much are we even talking about here? Say about... Mm, don't worry, I don't mind. I'll be back.
Thank you. All right, you go and take care of yourself, okay? I do. All right. And uh, it doesn't matter, whatever you can get for the kids, just try your best, okay? Well, sister, business is very well. Everything is going on fine. And for the family, I'm sure you know that they will be fine because I have already spoiled them with my Chief, Chief. This is my brother. I know what you are capable of doing. Well, I just uh, came into the village. I've not even reached my house, but I just thought I should come and see you first before I go home. And this is for you, okay? Oh my god! All this for me? Sister, this is nothing now, you know, this is nothing. What do you mean nothing? The last time you came home, you almost filled the house with food stuff. Huh? Thank you. Well, where is uh, Chukudi? Oh, that one. I sent him to collect my basin from Angu's wife. She gave mm. birth a few days ago. Oh, wonderful. Mm. I will see them later today. Yeah, please try and see them. I will, I will. Well, let me rush home now. Freshen up. I will see you later. It's okay. Yes, yeah, sister. It's all right. All right. Bye bye. So, um, I will never come to the house. Okay, to see I'll see you in the evening. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay. As I was saying, um, I would very much like to take Chukudi with me to the city, so I can help him be useful to himself. I don't like the idea of him being in this village and not being useful to himself. <sighs> Thank you so much. As if you knew what I had in mind, Chukudi would be very happy with this news. <laughs> Thank you. It's okay, sister. And I also wanted to ask you, do you have any challenges that I have to look into before I leave? Um, from now, no. I don't have any problem. The money you gave me the last time you came home, I've not used it. So I am fine. Hmm? <laughs> Um, that reminds me, that building that you abandoned many years now, please, it's time you finish that building, because it's very important. Sister, don't even go there. You see, that building is not my priority right now, because I have lots and lots of businesses that I'm putting money into. At the fullness of time, of course, I will complete it and everyone will be happy. But for now, that house is not my priority. Anyway, don't worry yourself. Um, tell Chikudi to meet me up early. interested in you. Ah! Ha! Look, what don't you get? I'm in a relationship and I'm getting married soon. Betsy, leave me now. Am I the only girl around? Felicia, since I set my eyes on you, something told me that you'll be my wife. Oh, please. Never! Ooh. But Felicia, you know I love you so much. My God! Please, 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 just, just get out. Just get out, oh! Go, 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 go! Stop stalking me. I've told you, I don't want you. Ah, this is getting too much. I'm very embarrassing. Please, 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 please. Let's respect ourselves. <sighs> ah, I've tried to tell you quietly, you won't listen. Now, now that I'm screaming at you, is that the one you like? Please leave me alone. But have it in mind that I love you. Oh, please. Is it Oh my god, 
Gracias. Felicia, don't you think you need to give Benson an opportunity to come into your life? Oh my god, not again. Hmm. I think she's right, you know. Benson seems to be a nice person. Please talk to her. No, oh, please. Please. Ah! Benson is not my kind of guy. Okay, fine, he does are not far from the truth. He's nice, but man, let's say I don't like nice guys. <laughs> no, I was just joking, but he's not my kind of guy. I think I like Marvis. He's cute, handsome, yeah, like intelligent, well educated, and he's based abroad, if you know what that means. But does it really matter? Besides, you don't even know if he's a drug peddler. Oh, patience, please. Ah, what's that? I think I'm old enough to know what I want. And Mavis it is. Well, we are advising you. Just that. We are advising you. You have your life to live. Thank you. Why don't you advise yourself first and get a guy for yourself? Thank you very much. I'm in the park line, so <laughs> the life is yours. Oh yeah, okay, don't worry. You know, I'm going to get the handsome. We are your friends and we want the best for you. There's something bothering me I want to discuss with you. Okay, go ahead. I need your advice, there is honestly. Yeah. I don't know, there are two guys like that, child. Two guys that want me to marry them. <gasps> Good! <laughs> <laughs> Wait, <laughs> this is a business man. One is a civil servant. Mm, they are both wealthy, but honestly, I don't know who to choose. Well, first of all, congratulations. Um, Someone has come to the age where marriage is a priority. <laughs> <laughs> and second of all, you are no longer a little girl, my darling. Follow your heart. Your heart will lead you to your happiness. I guess that's it. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. Don't forget, marriage is a big deal. So you don't go into it without due considerations. Take your time. That is the issue, Doris. Oh, please, I'm not Take ready for you. Take your time! Mm -hmm. What's that? <laughs> oh, please, do I have strength for it? <laughs> I don't have strength. Look at you, girl. Oh. I'm right in town. Oh, please don't mock me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good girl. <laughs> Oh my God, <laughs> if you accept my proposal, the traditional marriage takes place immediately. Marvis, I'm not in a hurry to get married. More like I don't just want to jump into marriage. We don't even know ourselves well enough. I need time, okay? I really need to think about this and get to know you a little bit better. Oh, come on, Felicia. What do you need the whole time in the world for? Look, I love you. I need you. I mean, I want you to be the mother of my kids. Just say yes. I'll give you everything you need. I'll take care of you, baby. Come on. Marvis, I know you can take care of me. After all, you're well-being. But I need time. Okay? Let me just think and let's get to know ourselves a little better. Please. Okay. It's alright. But, you know, the earlier, the better. Okay. Please, can you go drop me now? Alright. I 
Lord, I see the thing, the money don't cost me Hello, I'm on the Judea for a country can hear Come on, I'm not saying that you're not good enough for me. All I'm asking for is time, okay? I need more time to think. Marriage is not something we should rush into. We really need to calm down and be sure this is what we need for each other. Baby, what are you actually insinuating? All I'm asking for is time. Please. Please. Okay. It's alright. <laughs> I have to run off now. I have an appointment. So sorry? Yeah. I'll see you later. Vincent, I wasn't expecting you. How can you just budge on me like this? Could see the months you call me to tell me you're coming to my house now. Eh, Benson? Misha, my dear, I'm very, very sorry. I don't like it though. I honestly don't like it. Actually, I came to know if I accepted my proposal. I'm not done with my thinking yet. I still need more time. Felicia, my dear. I want you for a gift. I want you to be my wife. Benson, I've heard you. Eh? You said this time, time without number. And I said give me time. I need to think. Marriage is not something I would just dabble into. I need to really sit down and be sure of what I want. Please, I don't want to rush into marriage, Joe. Okay. Take good care of yourself. I'm going. Bye. You know, I see him coming to kill me and stuff. I just... There's just this ill, sickening feeling. I, I can't place it, but... I can't. Wow. Well, do you know what they say about instincts? Never ignore your instincts when they kick in. So, since you have this cold feeling towards him, it's only fair that you tread carefully with yourself and you avoid him in the meantime. At least you figure this whole thing out. Okay? you that I don't even like that guy for a second but you wouldn't listen to me look at what he has done to you 
Hmm? He has turned you into drinking. I don't know. I, I don't like it. See, Felicia. I want you to put yourself together, okay? You really need to put yourself together. You cannot kill yourself because of him. Okay? It has already happened. I just couldn't believe it. Get out of here this minute, I'll do something you regret. Baby, I came to apologize. I, I don't know what happened that day. I said, get out. Order, please leave. Oh. Don't get out of here! I'll give you what? Get out! You are welcome. What brought you to the shrine of Ekulo at this time of the day? I am Ecanuga, 
Hello? Who is on the line? Hello, Mama. It's Chukwudu. Mama, there's something I want to tell you. Okay, go ahead. What is it? Mama, can you believe that Uncle, uncle took me to a shrine? Well, you need to talk to you there. You got a body of blood on my head. Mama, I'm afraid you. Chukwudu, you don't have to be afraid. My brother can never, never harm you. All he's doing is to protect you. Please, don't be afraid, eh? But as I said, I just hope so. So, how is your uncle and his family? They are fine. Okay. Just greet them for me, okay? I'll call you back later. Let me go before they start looking for me. Bye bye. the whole compound and now you're cleaning the living room? Um, I have to do it before I go to the shop. Customer. Go 
Vous êtes là quand on va voir plus dans la fin quoi. Joseph, is this your shop? Oh, what? Is this your shop? What are you doing here? You say my products are fake? Huh? Aïe! Aïe! Voilà! Ouais! 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 Voilà! Oui, vous savez bien! You want to fight me? 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 Oh, yeah, come, come, come. Oh, that come by something. Leave this here, yeah, boy. Come up for a shop. Yeah, yeah, boy. Oh, that come by something. Oh, that will see one You know, I least expected this from you. How could you condescend so low to the extent of fighting the public? What would you have expected me to do? So I should have folded my arms and watched that little boy destroy my business? A business that I had grown and grown and grown over the years? Is that what you're telling me? Well, for your information, that boy has stepped on the tail of a cobra and the venom must destroy him. Well, I still think that you should have, you should have kept a grip on your emotions. What happened to your reputation? And what do you think people out there will think of? I don't care what anyone says or thinks about me. I don't care. As a matter of fact, this discussion is over. I want to be alone. Please. Listen, what I'm I want to be alone and now. I will so deal with him that in his next world he will never ever ever think of spitting on a man under the protection of Lord Shahun. Uh, please, Chief. I'm sorry for the rude behavior of my sales boys the other day. You see, Chief, these boys uh, devise different strategies just in order to get customers. Oh, okay. They devise different strategies to get customers. At whose expense? At my expense? Why would your boy tell customers that my goods were fake? Ah, uh, Chief, please. I'm sorry. And that is why I came to apologize on his behalf. Please forgive him. Chief, you have to warn your boy very well. Because the level of insult he dished out to my husband here is the kind that ordinarily we shouldn't let go. Please. I promise it will not repeat itself. I will just do exactly that. Well, Chief Camero. Uh, as my wife rightly said, you have to do a lot of talking to your boy. Because if this kind of a thing repeats itself, I will not take it lightly with anyone. Anyone. Uh, please, I promise it will not repeat itself again. Well, it's okay. It's okay, Chief. Um, and darling, now that he has apologized, why don't you get him some color nuts and drinks? Please, don't mind. I have an appointment to catch, please. Just a few drinks and uh, cola nuts. I'm okay. I'm okay, I'm just happy. All right, Chief I'm Amero, no problem. All right. Thank you very much. Okay, Thank we'll you. see more of you. Thank you very much. Okay. Bye for now. All right, have a good day. Thank you. Madam, please take care. <laughs> Oh!
Lord Shahum. Lord Shahum. Lord Shahum. Joseph, yours is finished. As no one touches the man, not that I care, go unarmed. <laughs> Done. Thank you, Lord Shaw. Lord Shahum. Lord Shahum. My man, come over here, please. Do you watch that match? No, boy, yeah. I tell you, I did oh. sleep with that boy, everything happened. Who we? I tell you, they asleep one thing happened. Now my sister just tell me, say, na pack I win the match. Huh? I tell you. For what? I pack I win the match, now. What did I hear? That is to Jonko? Nah, Liverpool. Again? I tell you, now what did I hear? Do you follow to Jonko? Nah, no watch him. Huh? I saw no watch him. Now the one where I know where I tell you now. Ah, that's your... That's your... That don't you chop money. Hmm. That's your... Why don't they make money from that? Are you serious? Ah, not for you. I never see him last time. Nah, come here and bring something. I'm not with Shaq tomorrow. I will soon go. Sorry, my friend. Baba! Yes, I will go shop tomorrow. Come, I beg. You don't even have a mama get you. See, leave that woman. <laughs> That's your chairman. Mm. They chop money where I want. And I tell you to mama get you don't die. You tell me leave that woman. See? That your chairman. Don't you chop. Big money, bro. Are you serious? Not for you. Joseph! <coughs> Joseph! Joseph, are you okay? Ah, Joseph, are you okay? <coughs> Joseph, are you okay? Joseph! <coughs> Joseph! see anyone near this particular room. What are you doing there? Is it not obvious that I'm merely cleaning the house? And what is it with you and this door? You are overly protective of it. The rule has been there even before you came under this roof. And I'm not going to sit here or stand here and entertain any questions from you. Okay? Is there something you're hiding from us? You know what? Don't mind the cleaning. Don't clean anything. Don't sweep. Forget about the sweeping. Go to your apartment. Doris, go to your apartment now, please. Go to your apartment. Business, having served me for this long. Oh, God, thank 
That's a good idea. We all know that Chief always keep to his waist. Yes, my dear. Many rich men end up not settling their servants. Exactly. That's why I call them Money Misro. Money Misro to my brother. And uh, Elder, talking about settling, I have decided to settle Chikudi with the sum of three million naira and one of my shops so that he can begin to be a man of his own. Oh. Mm -hmm. Good thank you. Chikudi. Here. The shop behind Eguha's shop is now yours from today. Oh, thank you, sir. Hey! Thank you, sir. Mm -hmm. I, uh, I don't know how to appreciate it. And uh, here's a check of three million for you. Thank you, sir. Oh. Thank you, sir. Hi, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Let me be a man now. You cannot be a man of your own. I don't know how to say thank you. Thank you so much. May God bless you. May God continue to flourish you with all the good Honestly, I feel even very bad to him. I've, I've made him feel like trash. You can't imagine the kind of things I've said about him. I just can't. I just can't. It's a goal. When it comes to love, I mean true love, most of those things doesn't count. Never feel that I feel like trash. Hello. Hi. Hi, Bello. Good you. No, 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 no. Okay. You're welcome. How are you? Sit down. Fine. How are you? I'm fine. I can see that I'm okay. So what's up? I'm sorry. I'm okay. I'm sorry for all the harsh words I used in you and all that. I was really going through some hard times, you know. I needed to get my brain settled, so I'm sorry. Well, stop that. Uh, I'm not God. And I believe in true God. I don't have any grudge against you. And I believe I love you. And I know what will be will be. So are you saying you're no longer angry with me and I'm forgiven? Oh. No. I'm all angry. <laughs> I'm forgiving you. Thank you. I'm just Mm, don't worry. After this one, there's another joint I'll take you to. Another <coughs> <laughs> joint. I don't know anyone anywhere. I didn't even commit that. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's the joint of guy used to go and get some things then before he settled me. <laughs> that reminds me. Let me even call my sister. Hurry on. Mm. Felicia, how are you and your husband? My brother, we thank God though, we are there, we are fine. I spoke to your mother the other day and she told me they have settled you. Yeah, so, please you will help me thank uh, Uncle Johnson for me. He settled me with a sum of 3 million naira and a shop worth millions. <laughs> hey, see Chukudio, you are not a big boy. And you do not give you the money for you to spend it all. This is time for you to be wise. Spend your money wisely. No extravagance. Beware of girls, Chukudi. Girls will eat your money and they will leave you. Oh, sister, trust now. Trust now. Eh? Don't worry, I'll talk to you later. Eh? Mm, no, 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 bye now. Thank you. I trust you, my brother. Oh, go and take care of yourself, okay? All the best. <laughs> Chima, get me a knife, oh. Oh boy. Money could do. You're three millionaire richer. Barman! 
Please get us some more uh, some drinks anyways. I don't want to drink more too. Mm, this part is enough for me. Guy, cool down. <laughs> My God, what is happening to me? Imagine my shop looking too empty and dried. Who would believe I was settled with three million naira and goods worth more than five million naira? Ay, my God. What, what's actually happened to all the goods and the money I made? I am just short of words because I, I don't know what to believe. Chukude. 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 What is happening to you? Chukudi, you have not started sobbing yet. Oh, now you're shedding tears. Very soon, you will shed blood. You will shed blood. So, I just feel I should come and see you. How is your husband? Hi there. Good friend. We travel to Abuja. We'll be back by weekend. Okay, yeah. mm. ah. You don't look bright, so I hope all is well. Honestly, Auntie, I must be frank with you. All is not well. And that is why I'm here. Did you know that my goods worth of 10 million naira has gone down the drain? What? I cannot boost off 100,000 worth of goods in my shop. How? Ah. What happened to all the money and goods and um, she just gave to you? I can just place it. I don't understand what had happened to me. I, you see, I, I don't even know. Everything just went went off like that. I, can, I don't know. I can't even give give account of it. I want you. I want you to stay away from women. Women will only squander your money and leave you. Chukudi, when did you start womanizing? Auntie, you know me now. I am not the women type. You know I only have one girlfriend. And as a matter of fact, she's not a demanding type. She only visits me once in a blue moon. So what happened? What happened to the money? Eh? What happened? That is what beats my imaginations. I said, I can't tell how that thing... I don't can even explain as mature as I am. See, it's just a twin, it's a flash in the palm. Everything just go. Everything disappeared. I don't understand this one. What do you want me to do now? Eh? I'm not working, you know, I don't have one. The only money I have in this house is 500,000. I'll give it to you. I know that can go a long way in your business. But you, you have to invest it wisely. If you squander this one, I don't know where else I'll get money to give you. God will bless you for me. Thank, thank God that I have you. Honestly, I don't know what I, I don't know what how will I explain to my people in the village. Oh, Yes, 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 you know this. 
is still not a process. Once you follow the due process, then you'll be able to get the right results. But I'm going to call you because I'm still at home now, okay? Let me do the calling when I get to the office, okay? Thank you very much. All right. This is Chukudi. <laughs> How are you? This one, you're in my house. I hope all is well. I, I came to get some goods from your warehouse. That's why oh. I'm here. Oh, this warehouse business again. Well, you know the way we do it. It's money before anything. So do you have your money? I do. No, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, uh-huh. Well, you will come to the warehouse in the morning at 8 o'clock. You pick your goods, okay? And, uh, how is business? Well, we are managing, we well, thank God. <laughs> As well. Come in the morning, okay? Okay, sir. My regards to Auntie. She will hear. All right, sir. All right. Okay, sir. It's not as if I wasted this money. I, I actually made good use of this money. It's just that I don't understand how this money disappeared. Just by moonlight. You disappeared. Really, really? What kind of cock and bull story is this? Eh? And you expect me to believe it? Disappointed in you. I am so disappointed. I don't have any money. I don't know where you want me to get money from. Ah, uh -uh. Masi, you don't know that times are hard. I'll give you three hundred thousand. But that is the only money I have, and that's the last money I'll give you. Chukudi, if you squander this one, you will go back to the village and go and retire. You will go back to the village and go and be staying with old men, probably tapping palm wine, because there is no other money anywhere to give you. So, Auntie, it's not, it's not what you think, oh. It's not. Only God in heaven knows that I made good use of this money. But the end, end point is, is what I don't understand. Chimwe! Chimwe! Auntie! Maybe I'll own. What's up for the good evening? Uh, how are you? I'm fine. I'll go to my room, eh? Mm -hmm. You know that the drawer, the one by the left. Oh, okay. Open okay. it, you see money inside. Bring it for me. Just bring everything. Okay, Auntie. <laughs> if I give you this one, I squander. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> You know now. I don't know what kind of thing. You don't know that times are. Auntie, here's the money. Mm -hmm. yeah, thank you. Mm -hmm. What? Take. Take. If you like, go and squander it. Honestly, Auntie, I, I don't know how to say this, but I promise that I'm going to make good use of this money. 
again. I, God will bless you for me. All I know is I don't want you coming back with bad news and complaints. Spend this money wisely and invest. Be cool. Chim, why get your uncle something to eat? Okay, Auntie. In fact, sister, I won't, I won't, honestly, I want to hide this from you. Things are not, things are very rough with me. My, my goods are going down by the day. Oh, that's not good. Are you sure you're not extravagant? Because if you are extravagant, you need to slow down on your expenses. And also, you should slow down on your social life. For all we know, women could be milking you dry. Sister, women has nothing to do with this. Oh. Whatever it is, slow down on women. But they won't help you. In any way. Excuse me, your brother is here. Excuse me. Good morning, sir. Uh-huh. Too good. How are you? Very well, sir. Okay. Yes, you were telling me something on the phone. About how you want to buy more goods. Yes, I... I just want to add more goods to my shelf. Goods worth 300,000. Good. That's good. You see, I am happy at the way you are turning it over. It means that your business is doing well, and I am impressed, very impressed. Oh, God, it's not what you think. Well, we still thank God, sir. Anyway, uh, do you have your money? Yes, yes, I do. Okay. Well, as usual, you have to come to the warehouse in the morning, pick your goods, okay? All right, you're good. Have a good day. Thanks. Okay. Lord Shalom! Lord Shalom! Lord Shalom! <laughs> to hold it, we must remain on our spell. Lord Shahoo! Lord Shahoo! Lord Shahoo! <laughs> Honey, hmm. your brother is on that spell. There's no doubt hey. about that. Yes. Sir, so, hmm. you could be right, though. See, the, the handwriting is clearly written on the wall. I, I could remember something some time ago when I was a child. When I first visited Uncle Johnson's house. He took me to a shrine huh? where a goat was killed and the blood was poured on my head. Hey! 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 Jesus! Chukudi! Auntie. Chukudi! Auntie. So this kind of thing happened and you did not mention it to me? Eh? You just kept it to yourself. No, it's not as if I don't want to tell anyone. I, I told my mother. But she waved it away and she, she said Uncle Johnson can never hurt me. That is, is possibly a protection. Oh! What kind of protection what? is that? What protection? Eh? That is where your problem eh? lies. Hey, God, Chief Johnson is an evil man. Oh, God will punish him. And it will never be well with him. Eh? Him and his generation will die a shameful death. Eh? How can a man do this kind of thing to his own nephew? Eh, honey? Oh, Jesus! Hi! Chukudi! Chukudi! You must have settled it with evil money. You are not far from the truth. Most of these evil men, when they settle their servants, they will go back to square one. Oh, Jesus! That is what is happening to Chukudi. Eh? So this kind of thing happened, Chukudi, you do not care to tell me. You do not care to tell me. I must go to the village tomorrow and see sister. Sister will tell me why this kind of thing will happen and I will not be informed. Eh? What kind of problem is this? Hi! God, oh, people are wicked. Well, Chukwede. Sir? 
You have to come back next week. Let me see if I can raise enough money I give to you to start off your business again. Thank you, sir. Don't worry. Thank you. Thank you. Don't worry. God bless you. Thank you very much. Hi. Thank you very much. People are wicked. Uncle, what am I going to do with my life? What is it again, eh? Hey. Jesus Christ. Look at now, the owner of the shop has come to take away shops from me. Just because of lack of payment. Hey. What, what is it? What, what is my life? What, what, kind of, what kind of life am I living? Although there's nothing in the shop, it's just a pair of, a set of television. Do you want to tell me there is nothing in that shop? God, this guy's really got nothing. Then, what happened to the 300,000 euros you told me you bought recently? How do you, how do you want me to explain this? God. Eh, Chooks, how do you want me to explain it? That after the day sales, when I go back to my drawer, I could find nothing in my drawer. Everything vanishes. Gosh. I swear to God, I, I can't explain this. As if somebody is in my shop. But nobody. This thing is not ordinary. Hmm? You need to check yourself very well. Can't you there's a force behind us? There's a force behind it. What are you still waiting? Must I explain everything to you? If you use your tongue and count your teeth. There's a force behind it. They ejected you from the house last time. Now it is sure. And your sister died here. This thing is the whole thing is becoming so unbearable. I don't understand. I can't just understand. Honestly. Eh? Yeah, that day your sister died. I don't just know what I don't understand. But this thing is because it's I don't know. Huh? It's okay. It's okay. What I'm saying is that Chief Johnson is an evil man. Hmm. Okay. That man is evil. Why would he take Chikuri to a shrine? And nobody would tell me about it. Eh? Now look at the, the, the calamity that has befallen Chikuri in this city. He has gone down to zero. So what are you insinuating? Are you saying that Chief Johnson, my brother, is the cause of Chikuri's problem? Sister, the, the, the handwriting is written very clearly on the wall. Oh. It is very clear now. Eh? Okay, see. He settled Chikuri. And then three months, only three months later, all the money and goods he gives to him disappeared into thin air. How can we explain that? He settled in with evil money now. Felicia, you shouldn't talk that way. Everybody know that Chief Johnson is not an evil man. Oh. What else do you want me to say to convince you? Okay, tell me. What would have made Chief Johnson take Chukudi to a shrine? Kill a goat and then pour the blood of the goat on Chukudi's head. <laughs> we all know what that means now. On Imaro. <gasps> that man is evil. Hey! Chief Johnson will die a shameful death. He wants to render my nephew, nephew hopeless. He will die. Wicked man. You people keep misunderstanding somebody here. Mm -hmm. That Chukudi misused the money given to him. Shouldn't make you label Chief Johnson, my brother, as an evil man. Okay, All these young boys. Okay, let me ask you. Is it easy for somebody to have settled someone with more than 8 million naira? Hey! Huh? Yes! 8 yeah, million! 8 million naira now. Are you asking yes, me? Yes. Ask you what? I've said my own, no. Chief Johnson is evil. I have said my own. Hmm. Go on, I want to go. I want um, Imagine. Hey, we all know Chief Johnson. We all know Chief Johnson in this village. Who doesn't know him? The boy don't we spend that the whole money. With eh? more than eight ah. million that he used to settle. So, Chief Johnson. Chief Johnson is a rich man. He's this. He's that. I know him too. He cannot do such a thing. Chief Johnson knows what he did. So, Felicia came to the village to rubbish my name. Chief, you need to see how she was shouting. And the rumor is everywhere in the village that you render Shukudi useless. 
In fact, she said that you gave him an evil money. What is evil money? I, I gave Shukudi evil money. Hmm? Elder, Felicia has bitten more than she can chew. Yes. I mean, why will she label me evil? And then she will go to the village and expose and talk about me. Anyway, Elder, um, I want to thank you very much for the information, okay? I will deal with the situation myself. Deal with how? Mm, I will deal with it. Thank you very much. Hmm? You are going back to the village now. from wondering a little boy that served you with all his heart useless. Your own nephew for that matter. Oh, you think I don't know you took him to a shrine where you poured good blood on his head? I'm not a kid now, I know what that means. It is obvious that you are daring me and I will deal with you. Uncle, we shall not see anything. We shall not see anything. What can you do? Eh? What shall we see? You cannot do more than a dead rat. I am covered with the blood of Jesus. Uncle, we shall not see anything. I will deal with you. You cannot do anything. I will deal with you. We shall not say anything. You cannot do anything to me. Felicia. Shameless evil man. Hey. Hey. Oh, you can't do anything to me. My God. What do you want me to do to her? I want you to first of all kill Benson, the husband. I want her to feel the pain of widowhood and then I will personally kill her with my bare hands. I have the photo. Leave the rest to me. The ball is now in my court and I will play it the way it pleases me. You may now go.
We are talking about your niece's husband here. Yeah. She is mourning. We need to go over there and commiserate with her. And I have told you that no one will go from here. No one is going there from here. Let the dead bury the dead. You know, that is a very callous thing to say. Let the dead bury the dead? She is mourning. This is the time she needs our sympathy, our condolence. Who are we even talking about here? Felicia. Felicia. You call Felicia my niece? That bastard, that idiot that has been going about castigating my name and running me down all over town? You call her my niece? That bastard? So that's what this is about? You still bear a grudge against her after all this time? Are you asking me questions? Are you asking me? How dare you? How dare you ask me questions? How dare you? You want to hit me? You want to hit me because I'm telling you the right thing to do? How dare you ask me questions? Okay, hit me! Go ahead and hit me! My blood, I see the thing, the money don't cost you all. My sister, I see the thing, the money don't cost you all. Oh. Hey, go away. Oh, need you dear for come to Kenya. Look at my in-law. He just died like foul when he has promised me heaven and earth. Nchukudi, you need to put yourself together. Okay? For the downfall of a man is not the end of his life. We don't have to say all this. Where do I start? Which way forward now? I'm even confused right now. I've told you time with that number. That tease doesn't help issues. Hmm? It doesn't. Where are you busting it? Keep looking up to God because He's our hope and refuge in times of trouble. Let me be. Is God not alive to see me so far? Why should life treat me this way when God is alive? Don't speak blasphemy. He's watching us, you know. Hmm? I believe with time you will change your story. I just hope I don't die before burial. Something will happen to you, okay? You will not die. You could, please. It's okay. Please. <sighs>
Yeah, I'm just so busy and I will just let the busy and the set and I will not deliver this baby and I will not and I will die. He said I would not deliver this baby and I would die. Oh, I'm saying this okay is becoming so unbearable for me now. I don't even know what to believe again. Julia, I, I, I can't lie to you. It was there. He keeps saying I would die in Chiba if I don't come out of this alive. Make sure you tell the world that you just killed me. He said I would die. Oh, oh, nothing will happen to you. Oh, okay. Oh, God. 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 Oh, Out of this alive, don't hesitate to tell the world that you just killed me, Auntie. Auntie, stop talking this way. Something will happen to you. You'll be fine, okay? I keep saying in my dreams, you will. He keeps telling me that I would not have my baby. And he keeps saying that I'm going to die. Auntie, he keeps asking me things. I've told him that nothing will happen to you. You'll be fine, okay? Josie said I'm going to die. He says I'm going to die, Chiwe. Auntie, that's the voice of the devil. You deliver your baby safely and nothing will happen to you. Just believe it, okay? Believe it. Oh, everything will be fine. Sorry, oh, sorry, 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 Yes, okay. Manti. Calm down, calm down. Can we read the husband on phone? Like, call me. Hey, husband. Doctor, Manti, that's why is dead, though. Okay. I hope there is no problem. There is just no talk problem. To I me. need you to put yourself together. Just calm down, okay? okay. You know what you do now? Just come with me. Okay. Next, I'm coming. Just calm down. Just calm down. Just calm down. Just calm down. Just calm I'm <laughs> <laughs> now the level room. Dead? How? When? <laughs> At the hospital. <laughs> I'm coming to the house. What's the problem? Who died? My sister. She died of child delivery. Jesus Christ. What when now? I said it. That devil. That devil. You should walk. Why are you shedding tears? What's the problem? <laughs> Felicia is dead! <laughs> Felicia is dead. Who is Felicia? <laughs> Felicia is dead! Felicia is dead! 
Is that why you're crying your heart out? You're shedding tears? I actually thought something serious happened. Anyway, I'm so tired. Can you give me dinner, please? Is that all you can say? Okay, what do you now want me to do? Because Felicia is dead. So because Fel Felicia is dead, I should run out of my house. You know, sometimes I wonder if you're still sane. Are you alright? Are you? Hey Doris, are you insinuating that I am mad? Is that what you're telling me? Are you saying that I'm mad? Are you, are you saying that I'm mad? Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Mama, I'm surprised. Honestly speaking, I'm surprised. About what? How would we lose somebody like Auntie Felicia? And Uncle Joseph never visited, not even a call to know how we are faring. Hi, Ashibakwa. God forbid. Hi. Chukwode, you talk as if you don't know your uncle. Eh? Your uncle is a busy man, and you know that. What, what, is, what is business? Is that business more, more better than a human being that we lost? Eh? Mama, I don't understand though. Sometimes you, 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 you talk as if you don't reason. I say, I'm going to go. I'm even afraid of you now. Ah, I don't okay. know if you are safe. Uh, it's okay. I have seen that you reason very, very well to call it. Please, if you have nothing else to say, go away from here. Allow me to have fresh air. Fool. I don't blame you. Since the time he bought that attachment on your head, your, your reasoning have changed. Who knows where you got the attachment from? Mother. Kimwe, why? Why have you decided to torment my spirit? Why have you made me so restless? Why have you refused to tell the world that Chief Johnson killed me? And, see, uh, and go ahead and tell the truth, Chiwe. Go ahead and tell them the truth. Go! Go! Do I start? No one will believe me. Considering the fact that Sister Felicia died during child's birth. And it's also dangerous for me to break such news. Knowing fully well that Chief Johnson is evil. No. No. I won't tell anyone. I don't want problems. Chimwe, why have you refused to deliver my message? Why do you want to hide the truth forever? Let my people know what killed me. <laughs> Auntie, <laughs> you know it's not easy for me. <laughs> you know the person is evil. <laughs> I can't risk my life. <laughs> Besides, no one will believe me. Stop giving me excuses, Chiwen. Go and tell them I did not die a natural death. I was killed. Go and tell them the truth and let my spirit rest in peace. <laughs> Go ahead and tell the truth. If not, you will join me by the next time I visit. Auntie, please don't kill me. Auntie, please. I will tell the truth. You must deliver my message. 
What truth are you talking about? Felicia. <laughs> you said to Felicia. She was there. And there is something she wants me to tell to be late. And her spirit has been disturbing me. Chimo, ah. Chimwe. What, what does she want you to tell the whole village and you refused? <laughs> she wants me to say that it was Chip Johnson that killed her. What? You mean Chip Johnson killed her? <laughs> oh, so that man is a chameleon. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Yeah? From all indication, it was Chief Johnson that killed Auntie Felicia. Hi. Because she keeps telling me that Chief Johnson was always chasing her around in her dreams, even when she was in the hospital. She keeps complaining of Chief Johnson appearing to her and telling her that she would die while delivery. No wonder. Hi. No wonder Uncle Johnson has refused to vi visit the village. Hi. Hey, now I've seen the handwriting on the wall. Yeah, Chiwe. Chiwe, you are too small. Chiwe, you are too small to be going about spoiling my brother's name. Chiwe, who told you that my own brother, one name Moke, the responsible for the death of Felicia? Chiwe, I am asking you, talk! Auntie, if not him, then who else? Barot Mouth. Now let me ask you. Was my brother the doctor at the labor room? Mama, 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 you don't have to blame her now. Eh? She's only saying what her uh, sister Felicia asked her to do. She's a liar. Does she look like someone that I've seen a ghost? Now out of this compound. I said get out of this compound now. I will go. I'm happy. At least I've delivered the message and Felicia said I should deliver. So I'm going. You are an idiot. Be ready to face the consequences when my brother returns. Useless fool. Mama, why are you supporting her? Why are you supporting uncle like this now? It, must, it be, must it be written on her face? Eh? Can't you, you just say it that the uncle has refused to visit the village since since sister died? See what? You, 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 you foolish boy. I thought I was at all here. How could you allow this little rat to brainwash you? And now, let me say Mama, all you are concerned about is being insulting all your children. Eh? And you are supporting an evil man. I don't know where you are. It is less clear. Let me see your leg here again. It's yours. So, my daughter, to go to this back to the village now. After my vision, I will be mourning with all the rest of the what am I seeing? Oh my God, sweet Olivia! How are you? How are you? I'm fine. Good. <laughs> Mama, how did she make it here? Um, what was his name again? He finally brought her. <laughs> yeah, actually, someone brought me here. <laughs> oh, come on, sit down, sit down, sit down. Are you welcome? <laughs> so you decided to come to my village? Of course, of course. You see, I just started to come and see you and know how you're faring. Hey, well, that's nice of you. Other girls would have abandoned their guys, you know, because of their bad condition. Just come on, how can you say a thing like that? You see, I always believe the fact that the future is not brighter, okay? Hey, whoa, hey, whoa. <laughs> Mama, see, she is the Olivia, the lady you I told you about, that you thought was eating my money when things were going wrong, you know? Actually, he has told me about you. So, how is he sitting? Very fine, man. Thank God. Mama, she came to encourage me. I, I, things will surely get better. I'm seeing her alone is hope. Eh? Um, let me just leave both of you to discuss it. Mama, that over lubu, that bitter leaf soup is what I want to come and eat. I'm hungry. Oh. I know. I, I see. Beg, bring, it, bring it over. Bring it over. <laughs> I see the 
Kagua Oni juti ya fani Kamju kene Eka mbuta de trafo Masisi tasiri Chief What is this rumor I hear about you having a hand in the death of Felicia and her husband? Hmm. Is there something about you that I don't know about? Well, I know you make good use of your eyes. And also, common sense should tell you right now that I am very, very busy. I have no time for this kind of idle talk. Idle talk? You call a sensitive issue like this idle? Well, like they say, for every rumor they raise some atom of truth. And for this truth I have come for. Tell me! I take it then that you are joining forces with those peddling wicked rumors about me, dragging my name in the mud. Your name? Do you even care about your name? If you did, why did you blatantly refuse to go to the village to pay homage when Felicia and her husband died? And you tell me about name? Doris, get out of my sight. Now. Of course, I will get out of your sight. But know this, I barely know you. Be with, with him. All. We should have known this all this way. <gasps> this word is terrible. Hmm. How can a man decide to hold a whole community in whole stage hmm. so that he can prosper alone? He will pay for his crime if he is found guilty. She will say it. Felicia mentioned of it, but I never believed them. You never believed them? Listen. The short and long of it all is that he will be summoned. Let's summon him. Eh? Yes. But you are supporting him. Let's summon him. Let's go. Let's go. Let's summon him. You are supporting him. You see, what they want is money. I know when they want money, they always create problems. They want attention. So, we will give them the money. Please. Just give them the I will personally just, give them the money so they will rest. Uh, Where is that he goat that slept with my son? Where is that the he goat? Eh? You? Ah. Uh, hold on, hold on. Uh, hold what? Just, give us a minute. Hey. So, you did not see, see anywhere down. to practice your evil, evil, ah, evil you. magic. Come and sit huh? down. Eh? Sit hey. down. See, you will come to my house. Eh? Whatever amount of money you want, I will give you. So that so this is you how you are money. making your money. Yeah, it's Destroying okay. other people's no. son. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Eh? It's okay. Eh? Hey! Don't let I will me. go and tell the villagers. It's okay now. Che, don't do this now. Eh? No, it's no, okay. No. Eh? no. Come to my house. Hmm? Hey! We will settle. Let's go. It's okay. Hey! Elder! That little son of his has mental problem. I saw the little boy dancing naked on the streets, and I said to the boy, let me help you. And then he went to the father and said something different. You see the problem, this is why I don't like helping people. Now, if I don't help, they say Johnson is wicked. He's a wicked man, let's kill him. Now, I have brought out my mind to help someone's son who is mentally deranged and the father is here raining insults on me you see people don't appreciate good things see? Huh? 
anywhere. Just allow the legends. No, no, no. Uh, let him go. Uh, the madness has probably affected the father. <laughs> so let them feel their madness. That is business. Let them This house. It's my uncle, Uncle Johnson. He's, the, he's a very wealthy man. The wealthiest amongst us in the village here. Yeah. Your uncle is evil. Eh? What? what? I said it. I know. As a matter of fact, he's the person holding the progress of people in this community, including you. Eh? Excuse me. You, you, you mean? But what did I know? My Lord will manifest his glory. Amen. I know. Amen. 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 Let's go. What? <laughs> oh, an ordinary reverend father thinks he can challenge. Lord Shaboom! <laughs> Lord Shaboom! There is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power. I said there is power. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power, there is power. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power in the blood, there is power in the blood. There is power, 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 there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power, there is power. I say there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. I say there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. I said there is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. I say there is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. There is power, there is power, there is power in the blood. Keep quiet. I rebuke you. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Keep I rebuke in the Jesus name. Amen. Amen. Holy Ghost. Amen. Fire. Hey, wait, wait, Holy wait, Ghost. Wait, fire. Wait, wait, wait. Let me say something. Wait. My people. Uh, I am evil. Hey. I killed Felicia and her husband. Hmm. I run evil. the destiny of everyone in this village. I make sure no one progresses. Mm. I rendered Chukudi useless. I took him to his to his shrine and took all his luck and wealth. I render everybody in this village. I take their luck. I render them useless. Even you, Eunice, you are under my spell. Joseph. Joseph. 
when you leave, you killed Felicia, your blood. You took the destiny of your own brother. Trusting you are very wicked. Trusting uh, uh, I hate you. Just, uh, I hate you. May God punish you. Yeah. Yeah. We are victorious. Hey, we are victorious. Glory be to God. I say we are victorious. We are victorious. Hey, we are victorious. Glory be to God. I say we are victorious. We are victorious. Hey, we are victorious. Glory be to God. I say we are victorious. Hello, I'm a Judy, 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 I'm a Judy,